Welcome to two rednecks getting shit face drunk. I mean, beer critic. <laughs> Tonight, we're trying Amstel Light, which is from Amsterdam. So we got a, another foreign beer from Holland this time. It's, so we'll see how she goes. I've heard this one's very... I've heard this one's good. Well, being from Amsterdam, I'm borderline worried about the THC comment, content, but other than that, you know. Sure, I hope not, because they do testing at work. Right. I swear I just drank a beer from Holland. Drink this beer and go buy Walmart out of Doritos. <laughs> Got the Amstel munchies. Well, hopefully we can avoid the AIDS, you know. Right. That's got a... So it's a lager. Yeah, I don't really see the alcohol barrage. I forgot my notes. <laughs> Doesn't say it has 110 calories, 5.8 grams of carbohydrates, one gram of protein, zero grams of fat. But fuck, you don't need to know the ABV. No, of course not. Why would you want to know that? Jesus, titty fucking Christ. The head down goes away quick. If my sense of smell wasn't bad enough, I'm working with one nostril at this point. I'm yeah. The change in seasons is screwing with my allergies. Mine too. That's why it's taking so long to get rid of we've been kind of sick. Yeah, it, bad week. Bad week. Between that and the trip to Kansas City. So that's kind of strong for a light, really. Ugh. I don't know, it has that better. She's got a bite to her. Yes, she does. And that'd make Anheuser Busch proud. Who the fuck makes this? <laughs> it's probably distributed by Anheuser Busch. U.S. Importers, Amsdale, USA, White Plains, New York. Mm. So it hasn't been bastardized. Maybe we just learned something new about Anheuser-Busch. Maybe it's from Holland. Mm. Yeah, Second gulp is a little better. Yeah. It, um... It's got kind of a coppery aftertaste to it, though. It's a little bit. No, it's kind of strange. I mean, it's almost like blood without the fucked up flavor in the beginning. Like, like blood without the loveliness. Oh. Same things like that, and I'm supposed to be the fucking elf. <laughs> you don't know what Santa does um, 364 days a year. Apparently it involves his red wings. <laughs> Keep Mrs. Claus around for some reason. It's, it's not bad. It's some... I always not horrible. I always assumed it was a... Uh, supernatural ability to hold her breath and zero gag reflex, but, you know, a 360-day-long period is just fuck. Well, they're old, so... He's... Now the Viagra's out, though, is kind of... Yeah, that's what I was going to say. The age of Viagra old doesn't mean shit. That is true, right? 
rise of Frankencock. A yeah. couple of my buddies that, well, one of my good friends outside of you, his old lady works at a nursing home, and apparently one of the most difficult things that they have to do throughout the day is watch the old people and make sure they're not boning. Oh, no. <laughs> apparently the women outnumber the men by quite a lot, so... Uh, they don't mind sharing, and uh, they'll actually wear the men out to the point of heart attacks if they're not watched. Oh my god. Well, I guess you have something to look forward to when you get old. Maybe I was wrong after the wreck and not wanting to go to a nursing home. <laughs> <laughs> Although I really don't have a granny fetish. Me neither, is that? Something I never understood. <laughs> Getting really off topic here. Make her come and it looks like there's fucking not. Uh, <clears throat> flower <throat> dust. <laughs> Just brush the car away aside. No, oh, wait, wait, wait. <clears throat> it's like... couple of drinks into this, it's actually starting to get a little bit better. Yeah. It would probably be a way better beer if this was the third or fourth one we've done in the night, not the first one. That is true. This one's... Because, fair warning, you're not going to see many changes of uh, attire over the next few videos, because <laughs> we've missed a week, so we're going to make up in the next hour. I just can't get over that copper aftertaste. It's fucking with me. A little bit. That's, that is very carbonated. It hits the back of your fucking throat, you know? Yeah, a Amsdale is getting a no from me. Yeah, it's... It's kind of interesting just to be able to say you tried a beer from Amsterdam. But, honestly, the aftertaste is just a little too close to bong water for my liking. I wouldn't know. I never drank bong water. <laughs> there was tequila involved. Get off me. Was it a bet? Huh? Was it a bet? No. No? <laughs> no. So you did this of your own free will. Yes. After most of a fifth of 1800 by myself. Like I said, there was tequila involved to get off me. Somebody suggested it, and I thought it was just the greatest idea in the world, and yeah, it wasn't. It was not. It was not a good idea. It did help me evacuate the 1800 that my body did not want to imbibe, however. I can imagine it. Oh. Expelled that shit, exorcist style. Quite literally, it's the first time I had to clean my own vomit off the ceiling. It was when you started masturbating with a crucifix, then people started worrying. Good, <sighs> yeah. Oddly enough, I'm the one of the two of us that hasn't found that in porn. Yeah, you can find anything in porn. <laughs> He showed me. It's disturbing. <laughs> and disturbingly arousing. You've seen The Exorcist, haven't you? Not that I can remember. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, a, it's a good movie. It's just... It's just fucked up. It's not as scary as people say it is, which... I don't know. I've never really found a movie that actually scared me. So... My senses are a little skewed. What well, fucked up? I have whatever the fuck that, uh, what's his name, Steve Hart, or... Uh, it's an older actor, I can't think of his name right now, but he's got like 26 kids or some shit. 
26 kids. Yeah, it's just a madhouse of children from adult to toddler and every fucking where in between. And no, n no. I'm confused as to what you're talking about. <laughs> I know there's the movies out there, I can't remember what the fuck they're called. But those are the movies that scare me. None of them are meant to be horrors. Most of them are supposed to be comedies. But when you start getting into the double digits of children, that's a fucking horror movie. Yeah. Fuck you, I ain't even got to hit the double digits. I think five oncoming traffic would start looking sexy. <laughs> What's she gonna do, Dad? Well, I'm just gonna go play in the traffic. Yeah. Because we're planning on doing multiple reviews tonight, I am not going to finish this because the copper is turning the fuck out of my stomach. Yeah. I, I would not waste the time. This... No good. No, no, no. No, I'm still like, no good. Don't waste your money. Between the ridiculous bitter on top of that weird copper taste, I'd actually say this is worse than Anheuser-Busch. Right on par. I'd say it's right there with Bud Light and shit. It's got that same bitter, but that copper is just bad. It's, yeah, it's... Amsa Light, don't waste your time. And as always, don't drink and drive. If you do, we'll show you what you can do with a crucifix. Mm -hmm.